Alright, so, as you can tell by the title, it says vlog underscore one. That's because I'm kind of restarting a new vlog series or whatever. Well, I'm just going to try to do this pretty much the rest of the life of the channel. Because, you know, I've already started vlogs like kind like three times already. Like, first one, you know, it's just regular vlogs when I was just messing around with it, testing it out. Second one was the actual, when I started numbering the vlogs. And I was actually putting music in them. And the second one, which is where I was doing a bit of a different style of, like, music and editing and that kind of thing. But I kind of haven't really stuck with that over the summer. I've only uploaded a few videos and none of them were really numbered or anything like that. So I decided to, you know, restart and instead of putting it at, like, the start of the video, like, in an opening clip of a time lapse or something like that, I'm just going to put them in the title because most of the time I don't even do that anymore. And there's no, there's not really anything I'm, like, sticking to. So these vlogs are just going to be whatever I want. So, like, some vlogs have music and edits and that kind of thing. Some won't. They'll just be... Whatever I feel like, really. I don't know how much I'm going to be uploading them. Just whenever I have time. And, uh, yeah, I think they should be pretty good. So I'm going to try to edit them a little better because now I have a little bit more time because it's not summer anymore, so the days aren't so long and hot and, yeah. Anyways, enough messing around. I'm going to go throw my gear on and then... I already got the bike ready and his bike ready and, yeah. <laughs> In case you're wondering why I put my phone in a bag and I put my boot, because it's kind of weird. I don't really have anywhere else to put my phone except for my backpack, and I don't like doing that because then it's just hard to get to. So I just put it in a plastic bag to stop all the dirt and stuff from getting in it. And then just stuff in my boot, it's way more convenient that way. Also, sorry if that intro wasn't very good. Hopefully I made everything kind of clear on what I was doing, but I don't know. It also felt really, really long, so that was, yeah. Also, I put a new pipe on my bike because the last few times, last few times I video, you probably noticed it was obnoxiously loud and sounded terrible because the packing was just fried in it. So, threw a pro circuit on there. I've been trying that out. I actually quite like it. it sounds so cool, like because they put, it, they made it so it has more of a deep tone to it. I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> Just a little bit. I don't know who that was. Hopefully this thing somewhat warmed up. I don't know why. It was pretty rich there for a second. It's a quarter pipe. <laughs> Make sure my brakes working before I try to wheelie. I think it's warmed up. Rain lately to keep the trails from getting dry because as you can tell they're pretty dry. 
but we have got a few floods like just recently but fortunately they're so dry but it did flood pretty hard like a few days ago so there's rain ruts everywhere so kind of got to be like aware of the trails a little more so catchy like so quick like so unexpected Woo! But uh, anyways, last weekend I was out riding the trails and stuff, just goofing off with my dad and my brother. And I really had to stay aware because they were so bad. And then, like the next morning, Matthew went out for a ride. And he like took his eyes off the truck for just a second because there was a car coming. And it, like a rain run or something, I don't know. Someone grabbed it and like threw him on the ground and now he broke his collarbone again. So, that sucks. So he's not going to be riding for... I don't know, like six weeks or so. Let's get some wide open two stroke for you guys. Not two stroke. Then you guys hear what that new pipe sounds like. Look at this. Woo! That sounds so much better. About to hit the biggest jump of my life in my entire career. Oh man, this is gonna be crazy. He's over there, he's gonna watch. Okay, nervous for this one, guys. Here we go. We got this. I made it at least five feet on that one. It actually isn't even a jump anymore. It's like two rollers on the side of a hill. You probably jumped the last one. Yeah, I like jumped that first roll at the bottom. Then onto the top one, I just kind of bounced and that's what threw me over the hill. It's so weird. All right, not messing around. Okay, so we're out at like the main part of Red Hills right now, Bonfire Hill. And I want to make a like a off-road GP motocross style course here and as you can see they got stakes everywhere like all the way through there i don't know what they're doing but it says uh something excavation on it so they're obviously digging something but like by the looks of the poles it's gonna be a lot of dirt moving so yeah might as well make this course real quick before they tear us all up we won't be able to ride here anymore but basically like the past it's actually been a month since i've made a video like, the last video I uploaded was two weeks ago, but I didn't edit that for like two weeks. So, sorry about that, but hopefully we'll be able to upload a little bit more now that it's going to be like fall and winter because I'll have more time then. And that was just kind of why I wanted to restart the whole vlog thing. Because I was really just getting out of it over the summer and stuff, and I wasn't too happy with where the vlogs were at, at the moment. So I didn't want to keep doing that that season or whatever. I just wanted to restart fresh. Anyways, I'm gonna ride around, try to find a place to make this little course. Then once I get all figured out where I want to go, I'll take you guys to a lap of the course, like, of what it's looking like then. And then I'm gonna do like a 15 or 30 minute moto on it, because I've been doing those a whole lot lately, just trying to get in shape and, like, being fast and stuff, because I really want to do good as far as, as far as riding goes. Because I kind of want to try racing this winter, if I can talk my parents into it do some like motocross races i don't want to suck i'm probably gonna be if i do race it'll probably be in the c class but i'd like to get up and did he crash i don't hear his bike anymore oh i see him hmm let's go see what he's doing it looks like his bike died I don't know if I was recording that, but he didn't crash, he was just trying to fix that road right there. Anyways, I'm gonna go try to get started on the course. Okay, just got the course layout all dialed in, got it, you know, written down in my mind to where to go. I just had him follow me a few laps so that he knows where to go, because he loves this kind of riding, like he wants to be in desert races and 
that kind of thing when he starts racing so he really likes it and i just need to practice a little bit more on the off-road style stuff because i've been doing a lot of moto stuff lately but i mean let's let's take you through a lap of the course before it all gets thrown in so i got my timer set for 33 minutes right now so that gives me time to do this intro and then some extra time for too much probably like a 30 minute moto on it so yeah let's take you guys through a tour of the course it's got flat track sections technical sections wide open sections jumps rollers burns anything you could ever want oh god <laughs> I just done I almost made it to the moto but I made it to like 24 minutes and then my stomach was kind of starting to hurt and I was like yeah it's close enough I'm just gonna call it but anyways as you can see the course is getting a little bit better road in now so let's uh do a lap real quick and then I'm gonna head back so let's we'll see if I got any faster <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
into my driveway okay is that so hard Chandler or Bryson go I don't know Doggy. Nice doggy. Hi wizard. Nice wizard. Hi box. What are you doing? Just took a quick shower. So now I'm gonna go out and wash the bikes off. I ran out of cleaning stuff, so I'm just gonna spray off the dust and that kind of thing. I can't really go into full detail on it. It's got quite a bit of oil and stuff that needs to be just cleaned off and that kind of thing. I think that sometime soon in one of these vlogs I need to do like a time lapse video of me cleaning the shop because it's pretty messy as you can see. You know, you need a good background for when you're doing vlogs. Alright, well I think that's going to be it for this video so uh, thanks for watching and uh, yeah, see you in the next one. <laughs>